Hello and welcome to episode 7 of Serial Review. Uh, got my coworker Paul with me again today. How's it going? And uh, today we're doing post frosted chocolate strawberry shredded wheat. Um, I had post shredded wheat before and wasn't a huge fan of it. Um, but you know what? I'm gonna like I'm gonna let Paul go first. Uh, what do you think about it? Um, flavor wise, it's not too bad. Um, you're definitely getting the strawberry from it. You're getting a little hint of chocolate. It tastes really nice. Unfortunately, it's not very consistent. Some pieces I'm getting no chocolate at all. Some pieces, just the strawberry is overpowering. Some pieces I'm getting absolutely nothing. It just tastes like a box. But um, overall, once you are getting some of those good pieces. It's pretty good cereal. Uh, I would give it like a seven out of ten. Only reason why I'm rating it so high is because you know it's got a decent amount of fiber in it, and there are worse ways to get fiber. But yeah, this isn't a bad cereal. All in all. All right. So you think so? Nutrition facts <clears throat> they weigh into your decision to give it a seven out of, seven out of ten. Well, slightly. I mean, when we talk about nutrition, I mean this is a breakfast cereal. Yeah. So, it's not the greatest thing in the world for you to begin with. No, but I mean... But we should get some fiber with it. Yeah, you're getting some protein. You're getting five grams, so you're getting five grams of protein uh, for serving six grams of fiber, 2.5 grams of fat. It's still on the low side. Um, 200 calories for 55 grams, so it's one serving. And then you're also getting 15 grams of sugar. So, I do want to mention... We are using um, 25 uh, cashew milk with 25 calories, so it's unsweetened. So that's probably, <clears throat> I think this allows us to, <laughs> sorry Paul, I think this allows us to, oh, Mr. Wilson from Home Improvement there. Yeah. <laughs> I think this allows us to really um, taste the cereal uh, for what it is, rather than Drinking it with milk, well, regular milk, a cow's milk, 2% whole milk, whatever, there's a lot of sugar in that. So you could be eating, you could be eating a bland cereal, like Wheaties, but if you, <laughs> breakfast of losers, but if you uh, have like a bunch of sugar in your cow's milk, you know, it's going to taste pretty sweet. I like to use unsweetened almond milk, cashew What's milk. That? Called cashew milk. That's cashew milk. Yeah, I didn't. Oh, those are milk. No, it's cashew milk. How do you milk a cashew? I don't know how you milk a cashew. So yeah, it had, um, this milk has uh, zero sugar, two grams of fat per serving. Um. So this whole entire box is two hundred calories. This whole entire carton is two hundred calories. So. Yeah. Um. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a six out of ten. Hmm. I, I don't think post... That was a good piece. What? You had a good piece? Okay. Yeah, that was a good Paul one. had a good piece. I'm going to... So, I, I don't think post um, shredded wheat is as good as... What is it? Kellogg's is the other one? Is it Kellogg's that has mini wheats? I think Kellogg's yeah. has mini wheats, yeah. I think Kellogg's does a better job with their shredded wheat. Um, but, yeah, I'm... This, this is okay. If you if you like shredded wheat, then you know I would recommend giving this a try. Um, it's one of their new flavors. I got this at Walmart. I think it was, I think it was only like three dollars, or two seventy eight or something. It was something like that. It was less than three dollars. So, yeah, it's really not a bad cereal. Just not one of my favorites. So, any more thoughts? No. All right. It's all right. Well, thanks for watching.